ಸದಸ್ಯ ನಾನಾಜನ ಸಲಾಕ್ಯ ಸಾಕ್ಷೂರ್ ಪುನ್ಮಣತ್ತನೇನ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುವೇ ನಮಃ ಟುಡೇ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ನಂಬರ್ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಪತಂಜಲಿ ಯೋಗ ಸೂತ್ರ ಸಮಾಧಿ ಪಾದ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ರಿಪೀಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಎಲಾಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ಮೀ ವಿರಾಮ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸಪೂರ್ವ ಸಂಸ್ಕಾರ ಶೇಷ ಅನ್ಯ ವಿರಾಮ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸಪೂರ್ವ ಸಂಸ್ಕಾರ ಶೇಷ ಅನ್ಯ ವಿರಾಮ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸಪೂರ್ವ ಸಂಸ್ಕಾರ ಶೇಷೋ ಅನ್ಯ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂಯೇಷನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ನಂಬರ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟಿ ವೇರ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಸಂಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾತ ಸಮಾಧಿ ಹಿಯರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಈಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಸಮಾಧಿ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಸಂಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾತ ಸಮಾಧಿ ಹಿಯರ್ ವಿರಾಮ ದ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ವಿರಾಮ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಿಸೇಷನ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿಟ್ಯಾಚ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಥಾಟ್ಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಲೀವ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೀನ್ ಎರ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸಪ್ರೇಟ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟೆಡ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ಪೂರ್ವ ಪೂರ್ವ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ಲಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ಲಿ ಆರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮರ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರೆಸಿಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಸಂಸ್ಕಾರ ಹಿಯರ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಬ್ಕಾನ್ಸಿಯಸ್ ಇಂಪ್ರೆಸನ್ಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾಬಿಟ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ದ ರೆಸಿಡುವಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಪ್ರೆಸನ್ಸ್ ಸಬ್ಟಿಲ್ ಇಂಪ್ರೆಸನ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಸಂಸ್ಕಾರ ಸೇಸೋ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ರೆಸಿಡುವಲ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಸ್ಪ್ಯಾಡ್ ಅನ್ಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಸೊ ಪ್ರೆಸಿಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಕಾನ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ವಿತ್ ಕಂಟೆಂಪ್ಲೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಟ್ಯಾಚ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ದರ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಅದರ್ ನಾನ್ ಡಿಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ಯೂ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕೊಗ್ನೇಟಿವ್ ಅಬ್ಸಾಸನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಅಸ್ ಅಸಂ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾತ ಸಮಾಧಿ ವಿಚ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ರೆಸಿಡ್ಯೂಯಲ್ ಸಬ್ ಕಾನ್ಸಿಯಸ್ ಇಂಪ್ರೆಸನ್ಸ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಟೈಪ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಮಾಧಿ ದ ಮೆಡಿಟೇಟಿವ್ ಅಬ್ಸಾಪ್ಷನ್ ಈಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸಿಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ದ ಸಿಸೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಮೆಂಟಲ್ ಮಾಡಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ಸ್ ರಿಸಲ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ರೀಡಮ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಸೈಕಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಓಲ್ಡ್ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಪತಂಜಲಿ ಮಗರಸಿ ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸಸ್ ಅಸ್ ಟು ದ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ವಿರಾಮ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ದಿಸ್ ರೆಫರ್ಸ್ ಟು ದ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಸಿಚುಯೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಮೆಂಟಲ್ ಆಕ್ಟಿವಿಟೀಸ್ ಥಾಟ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫ್ಲಕ್ಚುಯೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ಯೂರ್ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ನೆಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಟ್ರಾಂಕ್ವಿಲಿಟಿ ಪತಂಜಲಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ದಿ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಸಿಚುಯೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೆಂಟಲ್ ಮಾಡಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಪ್ರೀ ರಿಕ್ವೆಸ್ಟ್ for experiencing a different type of samadhi this samadhi takes us beyond the confines of old existence freeing us from the cycle of birth and death that is samsara the samsara often described as a cycle of world existence is a continuous journey of birth life death and rebirth it is a cycle of sufferings attachments and limitation but to the practice of yoga we can break free from this chains patanjali magarisi emphasizes the importance of abhyasa the continued practices it is through consistent and dedicated practice that we can cultivate the ability to still the mind and experience a state of virama pratyaya to achieve the cessation of mental modifications we need to let go of our attachments desires and identification with the external world this requires deep introspection self inquiry and a willingness to detach from the illusion of the mind by anchoring our awareness in the present moment we can gradually dissolve the mental fluctuations and enter the state of pure awareness this allows us to transcend the limitation of the ego and experience our true nature the state of samadhi born from the cessation of mental modifications takes us on a profound journey towards liberation it is a state of unity wholeness and transcendence where we merge with the universal consciousness here we are discussing about yeah, the layer from the last sutra if you understand we have discussed the asampragyata samadhi asampragyata samadhi 
where we discussed about vitarka vichara ananda and asmita how we are able to peeling up from the gross level of cognitive absorption gross level of cognitive absorption absorption from the observation reflecting rejoicing to the state of being other will be a state of i amness which is asmita here uh, once we are getting that the four states of uh, sampagna the samadhi we are getting into we are not getting into the complete realization still the subtlest impressions or samskaras keep disturbing us as a residue the birth and death the recycle of life happens because of this attached subtle impressions and samskaras which is the habituate of the consciousness even the rudra comes and take away this soul leaving this body material body the arrangements is made based on the subtle impression which we also called as karma to take an another body the another body is happening because of this karmic residual impressions the impressions the state of mind which the impression is in the subtle need subtle greed a subtle want is allowing us to take an another body which automatically will happen because of the left our karma so detaching getting into the asampratna the samadhi by removing this residual layers of subtle karma is very very important for us to achieve liberation from this samsara so it's very very important so the atma the soul as we know it is like beginningless it is there is no beginning and it takes a form because of our own free will so it is our own duty to practice yoga to realize our own self by getting the jnana by removing the agnana by getting into the layers of asampragna the samadhi to remove the samskaras so that prakriya very importantly the two things which is abhyasha that is by consistent practice so time and again patanjali magarasi is mentioning the continuous practice and also there is a verse which i already mentioned three sutras before like summayir which is quoted by ramana magarasi keep the mind still during in the thoughts completely find the first space between thoughts and at and just be in that space be present with it was that space expanding so find the space between two thoughts from one thought to another don't go to the another thoughts just be in sync sumair that means be in still with the same gap between one thought to another thought in this space where there is no thought your essential being is unencumbered by worldly concerns in this moment we are getting liberated in this moment our mind is liberated and we are liberating the process of samsara when we expand this gap completely where there we are reaching a no mind state the whole samskara the whole samsara the no mind state is achieved and we will become union with iswara we will become bhairava so this is a very important sutra so please once again meditate to this uh, sutra virama pratyaya abhyasa purvah 
samskara seso anyaha so please uh, chant this uh, mantra sutra from panjali yoga sutra this is a very important sutra where we are understanding even uh, uh, achieving the samadhi the first level samadhi is not very important realizing there is a samskara beyond that the subtle dot like uh, layer beyond the mind the samskara the subtle impressions uh, even when the, the subtle you can think before going to sleep the state which is between one thought to another thought the state is achieved the gap of the state which is the thoughtless state that state we need to expand that so remember this the path of liberation requires consistent practice introspection and a deep commitment to stilling the mind may your journey towards inner freedom be filled with grace and transformation thank you very much om tat sat om tat sat om tat sat please subscribe to our vedi books youtube channel by clicking on the bell icon